Hi, in this session, I am going to discuss about uh, how the entropy encoding is done in JPEG compression standard. So there are 64 uh, coefficients arranged in a matrix of uh, 8 by 8. First, I am going to discuss how this 8 by 8 matrix is converted into a vector through the zigzag scan. So out of these 64 coefficients, one will be the DC coefficient and remaining 63 are AC coefficients. Then I will discuss how the DC coefficients are encoded by using differential encoding and then the run length encoding of AC coefficients. So vectoring is a process of converting a two dimensional matrix into a one dimensional vector. So now you consider a 8 by 8 matrix of uh, quantized coefficients. So here the blue color box represent the DC coefficient and the remaining all are AC coefficient. So in order to convert these uh, matrix into a vector, uh, JPEG uses the zigzag scan. The scanning order is illustrated by a yellow line will trace the entire matrix. So now it will first trace 12, then 6, 7, 3, 3, 3, 2, 2, 2, 2 and the remaining element will be 0. The generated vector is shown on the right side of your screen. There you can see uh, the values 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 up to 63. So I am reading from the right hand side. So that represents the index and just below that you can see the values 12, 6, 7, 3, 3, 3, 2, 2, 2, 2, then it is followed by zeros. In a vector, there is only one DC coefficient and 63 AC coefficients. The amplitude of the DC coefficient is higher than all other coefficients present in the vector. So next we are going to see how to encode DC and AC coefficients separately. So the DC coefficient is the largest in magnitude. As a result, the DC coefficient is differentially encoded. So even in our example, we can see that 12 is the DC coefficient which is higher than all other coefficients present in the vector. So in order to encode the DC coefficient, you have to find the difference between the DC coefficient of the present block and the DC coefficient of the previous block. Suppose when the DC coefficient of the previous block is not given, then you can assume it as 0. Then only the difference will be encoded differentially. The DC coefficients are encoded in the format yes, 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 comma, value. So here uh, the yes, yes, yes represents the number of bits needed to encode the value and the value represents the actual number of bits that represent the value. The AC coefficient has a long train of uh, zeros. Hence, the AC coefficients are uh, encoded by using run length coding. The AC coefficients are encoded in the format skip comma value where skip represents number of zeros in the run. For example, consider the sequence 3 comma 0 comma 0 comma 3 then the number of zeros in the run is 2 and value represents the next non-zero coefficient present in the sequence and it is encoded in the form of SSS slash value where SSS represents the number of bits required to represent the value and the value represents the actual binary representation. In this way, the AC and DC coefficients are encoded in JPEG compression standard. Thank you.